And now we're on the inside, guys. Uh, if you'll come this way. There'll be a countertop that wraps around this beam right here that's supporting the load up there. Of course, countertop here. Propane fridge starts about right here. Uh, we're gonna be doing granite countertops in this one. On the other side, there'll be a staircase starting about between the window here, coming up to the loft space. And of course, countertops all the way across. Sink will be in the center, of course, right by the window. Propane stove with oven will be in this particular one as well. Uh, the bathroom starts you know, about right here. There's going to be a nature's head compost toilet in there. Of course, a linen closet. There's gonna be a combo washer dryer unit as well in here. And we're bouncing the idea of around of doing a, I think it's called an Arturo or Arfiro bathtub. Uh, if I'm wrong, then I apologize. Because our space is kind of limited, but I still wanted to give the option of a bathtub and a stand-up shower. So we're thinking about uh, custom making one of those for this as well. And obviously the loft is above us. This right now is six foot eight, so it's a good height and plenty of room up there as well. It's actually a 10 foot deep loft. We're gonna have some built-ins probably down the side and maybe on the front here so you can store your clothes and things. Uh, you can't quite tell right now, of course, but there's a cutout right there uh, for this roof uh, skylight by Velux, and it is a open hinge uh, roof window. So you can get completely out of the structure if you need to. It also has a flap on it when you put the hinge down, it lets it breathe as well. So you can always introduce fresh air into the space uh, without getting wet when it's raining, which is pretty important. Uh, these things are pretty small and we're gonna be doing closed cell foam. So it's gonna tighten the envelope up so much you need to find a way to add some fresh air in. So that's the reason we chose that particular skylight so that we can do that, okay? And if we come this way, we're debating on how we're gonna lay this out, but we're thinking a built-in that wraps around with a flip-out bed. There'll be a table that flips up for, for eating or just hanging out. Uh, the wraparound countertop is also designed for that as well for bar stools. And above us, of course, is a, another loft space. It's a little bit smaller than we would like it to be, but uh, in this particular one, it needed to be this way. So either it's storage or, or loft, you can fit a person up here if you wanted to. Uh, but that's another reason we're doing the flip out bed as well. So if you had some guests over, you can have somewhere to sleep. So um, I think that's about it for in here. So appreciate it.